this is going to begin to make a lot of sense to you. This is a key component or portion of this. Now watch this. Notice my SQL again to say select everything from the property owners table, but in front of it I put keywords that say non-sequenced valid time. Those keywords say, you know what? I want you to read some of those closed rows. You see, the beauty of these temporal tables is when people query them normally, it's the same as a normal table. They wouldn't even know there are closed rows. But for an auditor who wants to come in and see what really happened to the millisecond, they can come in and they can put key words in front of the SQL, such as non-sequenced valid time. And it says, I will show you everything in this table based on the valid time. And you can see, hey, Tara Tom, customer number one, owned this from January 1st to February 14th. That's when he sold it. And I can see that Socrates is here, and that's when he bought it. Here's some more beautiful extra SQL for temporal tables. Notice here in my query I say valid time as of the date January 30th. Select everything from the property owners table and they say Tara Tom owned that. At that point in time that row was open. Socrates didn't exist yet. And so that's how temporal works. You can actually go back and say, at this point in time, what did the data reflect? And they will tell you. If I want to see every row in that table, I can use this SQL. Non-sequenced valid time and non-sequenced transaction time. Select everything from property owners. All the rows are coming back a real clever idea to take the complexity out of temporal tables is to create views so that users can use these much easier without knowing those keywords. As you can see here, I created a view as, and I did a current valid time. Whatever day it's queried, they want to know what the current valid rows are. In the second example, I say non-sequence valid time shows me everything associated with that valid time. Creating views makes it much easier for the general user community to see certain things you want them to see.